Yongling Foundation held an AI forum themed Redefining Tomorrow, the AI Revolution. Among the speakers was Sam Altman, the CEO of OpenAI. During his speech, he emphasized his optimism about the future of AI and promised to continue optimizing ChatGPT and solve the risk that AI poses. FTV reporter Stephanie Yang has the details. Um, this is my third time to Taiwan, uh, and I wish I had a longer one. This is a, a very short visit, but it's been a great day so far. This is Sam Altman's third visit to Taiwan. Speaking at an AI forum in Taipei, he said that despite public doubts about AI, he is optimistic about the future of OpenAI. He sees great potential in employing OpenAI in the fields of education and healthcare. We've been calling for sort of regulation, but only of the most powerful systems. We say, you know, let the small models go, let open source go. Models that are like 10,000 times the power of GPT-4, you know, models that are like as smart as human civilization, whatever, like those probably deserve some regulation. It seemed to me like the least controversial thing I was going to say this year. And I got completely, still am getting bashed for it by the tech industry. And there's this reflexive anti-regulation thing. But regulation has been not, an, not a pure good, but it's been good in a lot of ways. Things that I'm particularly excited about are uh, education, healthcare, uh, personal productivity tools, like what we see people do using these coding tools. That's been amazing. When asked about AI's risk, like misinformation and reinforcement of biases, Alman said it was important to set boundaries and input human feedback. It's certainly true that if you just train a model on the raw internet, you're going to get something that most reasonable people would call biased in different ways. Um, but with techniques that we and others have developed, like reinforcement learning from human feedback and a whole bunch of other things, you can surprisingly steer these, uh, these models. And so you can kind of configure it how you want. OpenAI makes some decisions, but you can change it a lot. And this idea of empowering individuals, but setting the, the edges and also the sort of standard behavior well, I think is really important. On the ways to make AI more sustainable, Altman said that fusion or solar nuclear powered green energy may be able to provide a safe, clean and cheap source of power at scale. Yeah. Fusion. And if that doesn't work, then solar. Um, the, the energy needs as we look out are enormous. Uh, the, I think the cost of intelligence over time should trend towards the cost of energy. And there's going to be huge demand for intelligence and thus huge demand for energy. And if we can create abundant, cheap, clean, safe energy, uh, and again, I think we're gonna have this very soon with fusion at massive scale, like the scale that you need for everybody on Earth to get to enjoy the fruits of AGI. Um, that's our plan. Experts speaking at the forum said that while there are concerns surrounding AI, they hope to work together to solve its risks. FTV reporter Stephanie Yang and Hu Chongwen in Taipei.